This is the tale of a young girl who was born in the northwest of Hanoi close to the border with China. It's a mountainous town known for its breathtaking scenery and vibrant ethnic culture. The young girl was born to a hill tribe villager couple who had suffered hardship during her childhood and then made a life changing when she met an old couple from America. Let's watch this video to see how her life has changed from childhood into adulthood. As Lily delved into her education in America, she navigated the challenges of middle school with determination and resilience. Supported by her adoptive parents, she flourished academically and socially, bridging the gap between her Hmong roots and the vibrant tapestry of American culture. Years flew by, and Lily found herself adorned in a cap and gown, graduating from high school with honors. Her accomplishments were not only a source of pride for her adoptive parents, but also a testament to the dreams she had carried from the hills of Sapa to the halls of American education. Lily's journey continued as she pursued higher education at college, fueled by her unwavering commitment to making a difference in the world. The old man, her adoptive father, remained a pillar of support throughout her college years, sharing in the joy of her achievements and offering guidance during challenging moments. However, as Lily approached the pinnacle of her academic journey, preparing to graduate from college, a shadow fell over the family. The old man, who had been a source of wisdom and love for Lily, passed away. His departure left an indelible mark on the family. And Lily felt the weight of grief mingled with gratitude for the years of support and encouragement he had provided. In the wake of the old man's passing, the old woman, Lily's adoptive mother, decided to document their shared life journey. With a heart full of love and a desire to ensure Lily's continued success, she wrote a will that detailed the family's living arrangements, financial assets, and real estate. In doing so, the old woman aimed to provide Lily with a secure foundation for her future. The will served as a testament to the deep bond forged between Lily and her adoptive parents, transcending the boundaries of blood and culture. It reflected the old woman's commitment to ensuring that Lily's dreams would continue to flourish even in the face of life's inevitable uncertainties. Armed with the knowledge that she carried the dreams and legacy of two worlds, Lily graduated from college with a profound sense of gratitude. The old woman's foresight and love, encapsulated in the written will, became a guiding light as Lily stepped into a future filled with possibilities. As she embarked on the next chapter of her life, Lily carried the lessons learned from Sapa, the strength gained from her adoptive parents, and the knowledge that her journey was not only her own but a shared narrative of love, sacrifice, and the enduring power of dreams. With a master's degree in education in hand, Lily felt a profound calling to give back to the community that had shaped her early years. Returning to her hometown in the hills of Sapa, she embarked on a mission to bring the gift of education to the village. Children, just as her own dreams had been nurtured. Lily's return was a homecoming celebrated by the villagers, who remembered her as the spirited girl with dreams as vast as the mountains that surrounded them. The small school in the heart of the village became the canvas on which Lily painted the colors of knowledge and opportunity. As an English teacher, Lily poured her passion into the minds of the village children, opening doors to a world beyond the terraced fields and misty hills. She infused her lessons with the rich tapestry of Hmong culture.
ensuring that the children not only learned a new language, but also embraced the beauty of their heritage. The school buzzed with excitement as Lily's infectious enthusiasm for learning captivated the young minds. Her classes became more than just lessons, they were a bridge connecting. The traditional ways of life in Sapa with the broader horizons that education could offer. Lily's impact rippled through the village, inspiring not only the children, but also the elders who saw in her the embodiment of hope and progress. The once remote village now echoed with the laughter and chatter of children, their dreams expanding with each passing day. Beyond the classroom, Lily initiated community programs, encouraging parents to actively participate in their children's education. She organized workshops, cultural events, and language exchange programs. That fostered a sense of unity and pride within the village. The old woman, Lily's adoptive mother, watched with immense pride. As the legacy she and her late husband had cultivated continued to bloom in the hills of Sapa. The written will, crafted with love and foresight, had set in motion a chain of events that transformed not only Lily's life, but the lives of an entire community. Lily's journey from the misty hills of Vietnam to the halls of education and back to her hometown had come full circle. She had not only achieved her dreams, but had become a beacon of inspiration for generations to come. In the quiet hum of the village school, amidst the terraced fields and ancient traditions, Lily's story continued to unfold. A testament to the enduring power of education and the transformative impact one individual could have on a community. Lily's return to Vietnam not only marked the beginning of her teaching journey, but also opened the door to a chapter of her life that would intertwine her past and present in unexpected ways. As she settled into her role as an English teacher, fostering education in her beloved village, another thread of destiny quietly wove itself into her story. One day, as Lily strolled through the familiar paths of Sapa, she crossed paths with a face that felt both foreign and intimately known, her childhood sweetheart, Tua. Time had sculpted him into a young man whose eyes still held the echoes of shared childhood laughter and adventures in the hills.